Hello everybody and welcome back to Asagao Academy Normal Boots Club Academy. Sure, why not? In this episode, we're gonna uh, do something in the classroom. Apparently talk to Mai. Oh yeah, we she was blushing last time. We were trying to figure out why. Let's let's just see if we can do that. Hey, one second. Class. Class, sit down and shut up. Today we're going to be talking about proportions of height and differentials. Now, the height of a woman is never a good reason not to date her. Well, you know, if if you really, really don't find tall women or short women or whatever height of women sexually attractive and... I mean, I guess I can understand not wanting to date them. It's, I think it's understandable. Kind of have to have that sexual attraction in a relationship. Anyways. Ouch. It was going to be a long day. So, it came. I was standing in front of PVG's dorm. Heart pounding. Fist up in the air. One second. I am trying out a new recording strategy, but it's hard as shit to deal with. Simply because I am underneath a giant blanket right now, and it is not. It's covering my second monitor so much, and that's where I keep all my recording shit. So, yeah, that's fun. So it came that I was standing in front of PBG's dorm, heart pounding, fist up in the air. You can do this, Hannah. Just knock. We never set a time up, so... What if noon was too early? What if I knocked and he answered and had completely forgotten? What if you didn't want to hang out anymore? What if I was late? Yes, you were late to the meeting that was never set up. And then there was the fact that, well, he was a boy and I was going to be hanging out in a boy's room, alone, with a boy. Of course, I trusted PBG wholeheartedly and it's not like he was just any boy. He was basically a brother to me. But just because I had recently reacquired fond memories of him didn't necessarily mean I could trust him. He might not be the same person. Uh. Oh my god, Hannah, knock on the door! Hey! Uh, hey! Something wrong? Ah. Jeff stood over my shoulder, squinting at me. What are you doing here? Uh. I, uh, I'm here to see PBG. He tilted his head to the side. Right. Uh, so you, so you are. Okay. Uh, s sorry, am I in your way? <laughs> nope. Uh. Oh. Okay, then. Awkward silence filled the room. How long was he going to stand there, staring at me? Why wasn't he moving? Was he waiting for me? I'm gonna readjust again. Uh, I wanna get into a comfortable position. Okay. Why wasn't he moving? Was he waiting for me? I didn't want him knowing I was going to PBG's room, but what else was I supposed to say? <laughs> Bye. I'll see you later, Hannah. With that, he turned on his heel, 
back the way he came. These guys were the worst. These guys were the worst. I'm, s I'm sorry, he walked up to you, said hello, wondered what you were doing, and then he walked away. How does that make him the worst? Exactly. I don't... I just don't... I just don't get it. Why, why is he a bad person for that? They'd be the death of me. There was no way I, they wouldn't. And get some cookies. That'll be good. Hana! Uh, Hana. Uh. Uh, oh, uh, uh, PVG, I, I, um, I'm here. Uh, whoa, yeah, you are. I almost thought you weren't coming. Uh. Oh, am I late? <laughs> no, of course not. I was just overthinking things again. Never mind, come in. Weren't you just leaving? Mm -hmm. You paused and stared into space over my head. Was I just... <gasps> oh. oh. Uh, no worries, I, I don't need to leave if you're here. Oh, I am sorry, I don't have any cookies for you. You were gonna get me cookies? This is a life-changing moment for her. She has never gotten cookies in her life. It's crazy, guys. <laughs> what kind of hangout sesh? Sesh. What kind of hangout sesh doesn't have cookies? Jeez. Yay! Yeah, cookies! <laughs> Let's go get them, then. Okay. The fluorescent lights bub buzzed above our heads as we prowled the school store. A small area connected to the cafeteria that reminded me of a gas station. I picked myself some strawberry milk and followed PBG behind. As he stood. As he stood, that's what that says. As he strode up and down the snack aisle, muttering to himself. Hmm. Too rough. Not the right ones. It was kind of funny, to be honest. At first, he gave off the impression that he didn't take anything seriously. The world was just a big, giant playground, and PBG was rolling around it, trying not to hurt anyone. But it seems as if it was something he... It seems... It seemed, if it was something he took seriously, soccer, friendships, or even something as silly as snacks. <sighs> Unhealthy, this is... Is it so much to ask to find good food? He took it very seriously. Do you not have a favorite kind of cookie? PBG jumped and spun around to look at me. He had, had he forgotten I was here? I, uh, yeah, but I, I do, but I was kind of looking for something else. They don't have it? Hmm. They might, but I just don't remember which one it was. I think they changed the packaging or something. What are you looking for? His face darkened as he started to pout. I, I didn't want to tell you. Why not? He stamped a foot and glared a row. He glared at a row of cookies. Rolling a 20 on this intimidation check. I wanted it to be a surprise. <laughs> I laughed. Really stupidly. 
How is it going to be a surprise when I'm standing right next to you? It's, it's not the same thing. Do you remember those cookies we always got at the corner store? They came with little toys. They were awesome. And we split them in half. They We split them half and half. Sure, why not? And we split them half and half, so you got the cookie and I got the toy? Oh. I wanted those again. Then why was he saying things about crunchy and smooth and shit? If all he wants is a toy and a cookie. He didn't even eat the cookie. He never ate the cookie. He said it himself, he just got the toy. Those are illegal now. What? what? Why? Kids choked on the toys, I think. His eyes narrowed. Charles. Uh, Charles? The kid of the new generation. The kid of the new generation. As exemplified by Charles. He's ruining everything and will continue to do so for the rest of our lives. Really? Oh... Re really? PPG raised a fist into the air, staring into the sky. Ugh. Curse you, Charles! Curse you! I'm surprised I didn't peek a mic. <laughs> what? This isn't. This isn't funny. This is awful. <laughs> no, it's. Uh, it's really funny. In the end, we decided to get the fateful standby chocolate cookies and headed back to the dorm. Not chocolate chip, chocolate. I was busy laughing at the register and that I... Sorry, I was so busy laughing at the register that I didn't notice him paying for my drink until all was said and done. When he handed it back to me, I said thanks, but an odd feeling sat in my stomach. This wasn't a date, right? This is some inherent sexism going on right now. Mr. Uh, Mr. PBG having to pay for having to pay for food. Apparently it's only a date when the when the when the man pays. Otherwise it's just hanging out, right? Is that how that works? That's a bullshit. I'm not being serious at all, by the way. Ellipses. I liked PPG, but I didn't think it. Uh, I'm sorry. I didn't think I wanted it to be. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't think I wanted it to be. Oh, a date. I guess that's. I guess that's what they're referring to. Yeah. I. I think PPG agrees. We sat on the floor of PBG's dorm room, a small monitor, and an... Oi? We? Oh, I guess it, I guess it's a, a, little, a little Nintendo joke. It's a Nintendo Wii, since it, that's Wii in French. Or it's... It's yes in French, but that's how it's spelled in French. We In front of us... He waved two game boxes on the floor. I'm sorry, he he waved two... Okay, he waved two game boxes on the floor. Here we have a uh, mar marionette party and stupendous stomping sisters. So, so, Mario Party and Super Smash Bros. Cool. Which one do you want to play? I heard both games. Marionette Party was the kind of game you played when you wanted to end your friendships. Uh, Super Smash Sisters was the game we played last week. I stared at the boxes doubtfully. I don't think I want to end my friendship with you. What? Uh, I'm sorry. What? So let's play Stomp. Uh, that was okay. Sure, fine. That's... Yeah, that doesn't sound psychotic at all. He put the disc in the Wii and 
started up the console. I'm gonna have to edit this music to be quieter. In no time, we picked our characters and we're having a one on one battle. No, 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 no! <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not just gonna let you take all the net Noki balls. Okay, sure. It's the only way I can save myself. You're spamming, spamming down B. No, I'm not. Or sorry, no, I'm not. No, oh, I'm sorry. BBG's Pikachu jumped across the castle grounds, chasing after my pink ball of fluff. Not fair, not fair. There was no real way I could use my rock smash attack if he was just going to spam down B. I mean, that's. I think that's true. I don't know if Thunder actually interrupts. The rock attack, if it's already formed. And I don't think Pikachu has invincibility frames when he's in the Thunder form. Anyways, my fluff ball might go invulnerable for a few seconds, but the lightning was too quick. This was the worst. There is no way in hell I'm going to lose. <laughs> Give it up, I've been playing this way longer than you. I threw another Noki ball at him. He jumped over it and landed in front of me. I lifted into the air and tried to shift into rock form. He quickly tapped down B. Game. It's not, it's not, it's not echoey enough, but, you know, it's just... Game. Something like that. That was horribly peaky, though. Maybe that's why the mic peaks so much, because it's echoey. I don't know. We well, stared at the screen in amazement. Uh. Uh, what? Uh, what? What just happened? The ending screen came up. There was my pink ball of fluff dancing away in the center of the screen. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. I, th I think I won. How you would not see the outcome of this trial is completely beyond me, but whatever. Ugh. You just shot off the screen like a rocket. I don't even think you hit me. Um. Um. I'm sorry. He rolled his eyes. Don't apologize for beating me, jeez. I held my tongue, resisting the urge to apologize again. Let's play again. We clicked through the ending screen. PBG adjusted the stock option to three lives and started up another battle. Uh, sorry, sorry, peeking. Three, two, one. Go! Yeah, that's definitely the freaking echo. Jesus. That intensifies it so much. Hmm. There's no way you're winning this round, though. I... Okay, I thought that was a mole for a second. I was just gonna be so, so much more pissed off by her design. Her design is already terrible. Not to mention the fact that she has... What the fuck? What the actual fuck? How does she naturally have pink hair and brown fucking eyebrows? What the hell? What the hell is this shit? I just don't... My anger... My anger is so... Angry. That doesn't even make sense. I just, I can't. I can't even. My evens can't. What in the actual fuck? <sighs> Whatever. If you like this video, feel free to like the video. If you just like the video, feel free to dislike the video. If I can actually talk very well. Smash. Smash, smash. 
share. You can also comment and favorite and share it on social media. Follow me on social media. And of course, subscribe to this channel. Probably not for more of this bullshit. Because I think this was the last straw. What in the hell? What in the actual hell? Why does she have brown eyebrows? I don't know. I mean, we're going to save it anyways. So may as well. Anyways, thank you everybody for watching. I'm Morbid Hobo. And with my hopefully non echoey voice, goodbye. Peasants.